Well, hello, Shelly Rocks here. Welcome back to RimWorld Hardcore SK. Hardcore being the operative word. I'm still struggling with this series. I've been trying to play this a little bit off uh, camera. And uh, yeah, we're having an absolute nightmare. I'm really, really struggling getting anyone to do anything. Uh, you currently uh dallas is uh injured i had i had some uh, i had a raid come in and we've still got a bit of the raid left in fact they are up here this is a couple of people from the uh the branfa the branner pact uh everyone just keeps breaking into really bad moods um we're constantly running out of food even though look at all the food i've got here i've got loads of food we can't cook meals in bulk yet We've got um, a steel fuel stove there. That is not letting me cook meals in bulk. So we're having to do meals really slowly and it's taken a while. So I don't think I can, can I make pemmican with this one? No, we can make kibble. I mean, I have got meat in here. Some of that's ready. Okay, they are decided to attack me. So I am gonna have to, oh, 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 wait, wait a minute. Who's, who we're struggling with? Oh, Dallas, brilliant. Yeah, you just fell over. Right, um, someone's going to have to rescue you, so it's going to be you. Uh, Brenlian, if you want to come out with your gun here. I don't think they've got armed weapons. Let's have a little look at them. Is that a blowpipe he's got? Yeah, he's got a blowpipe, and he's got a bow. So hopefully my gun will deal with them. I've already got I've got two people doing chefing and it's not really uh doing that good a job at the moment. We'll get everyone's just raging and as you can see just collapsing. Can you tend what well, why did you collapse anyway? Let's have a look at your health. You've had a catatonic breakdown. <laughs> I don't think I should start a new series with people that are dependent on stuff. Okay, here we go. That's one engaged. Okay, let's fall back a little bit. See if we get some cover behind these trees. Okay, looks like he tried to escape and he's got pew pewed in the face. I think the other one. Oh, the other one's shooting at Ray. Look, let's bring you up a little bit. Come on. Come on, Ray. Come to cover. Now, can you shoot from here? Yeah. Come on, engage. Okay. I think. Nice. Okay, let's have a look at these. So, when are these going to die? That's gonna, that one's going to die in two hours, and that one's going to die in four hours. Um... I really feel like I should get some more people. Let's look at the stats first, see if they're actually worth saving. Um, you're not really... You're good at melee, that one. Uh, that one's good at shooting and melee. You're a fanatic, but you're a slow learner. I think more people are better, because I think we're all going to... These people are all going to die off. Tempted to try and capture you, Anteater. Okay, let's make this into a prison bed. And Bren, if you could go and capture that one. Forgan. Let's oh okay. Fal Falcon's having a bit of a, a break in bed. Let's see if we can uh calm you down quickly. Come on, calm down. Now I should have two people. I think I've got Dallas is our chef, and so is Falcon. So we have no chefs at the moment. Fail to calm them down. It's not good. Who's doing doctrine at the moment then? Arik. Who is currently asleep? So Arik, you're gonna have to dive out of bed. Get tending them. Let's see. Was it four hours? 
or two hours. Oh, wait a minute. That is not <laughs> what I wanted. Um, when are you dying? The other one's dying. Oh, come on. This one's really unhappy, though. I reckon it's going to rage before you even bring them back. Let's see. Let's see if you can manage. Bring them back. Tend them. No, see. Another body in the floor. Okay. That's not a prisoner bed anymore. Let's hide the evidence. Come on. Hide the evidence. There we go. You were carrying some silver ore and some Saikai tea. Now, I've got some stuff that need building. Um, uh, we're building some more components. Cause apparently, I need... I want to keep a supply of 10. I killed some elephants and got some meat, but not a huge amount. So, we've got a little bit of jerky from there. Which you're taking out now. And he's filling it back up. Good. A little bit more meat there, though. Surely, we can fit more meat in this. Okay. No, I can't fit any more in there. Got me tomatoes growing over there. Come on, Falcon. Join me. Join me. Failed. Oh. It's so annoying when they just, like, not do what I want them to do. Falcon's one of the only happy ones, I think. I think we might have to build a mirror copy of this, you know. Let's try and quickly get this done. Build this. And at least I'll have two jerky racks then. Because that elephant meat's going to go to waste otherwise. So if we take all that, stick it in there. Take all that, stick it in there. Then we can get some delicious meat from that. Okay, so apparently we can only stick three lots of meat at a time on. I don't know why we can't have that, though. That meat there. That should fit in there. Apparently not. Okay, so I've got a lot of upset people at the moment. I really don't know how I'm going to cheer all these people up. It just seems to be we've not got enough people cooking meals at the moment. My two chefs are Cook, uh, oh, sorry, Dallas and Falcon. I've got no one else that can do cooking. I mean, I could have Ray help out, but. Oh, well, we could. Ray is raging in bed, look. I do think if these don't recover soon, this this is going to be the end of this uh, this series. I don't know how we can uh, keep with this. Let's get rid of all of that rubbish, right? We've uh, we've got a, a panda self-tamed. In fact, these are all just taking up all of the and a fly. I don't want any of these. These are all taking up valuable food. Let's get rid of them all. Consuming coconut. So you know you're onto a bad a bad run in the game when everyone's just eating coconuts. Look, another one eating coconuts. Can you kindly all stop eating coconuts? Um who's raging? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Eric's having a bit of a bit of a rage down there. Hopefully he keeps it to that room, doesn't break anything else. Okay, he's no longer having a tantrum. Good. Right, can we convince can we convince you to stop? Stop raging. I really want you to get out of bed. I don't think you're gonna get out of bed till you're you've got this catatonic breakdown. Oh, brilliant. Now you're eating the raw meat. Um, oh, dear. 
I have added an order on here for cooked meat soup, but no one seems to want to cook at the moment. Can't cook. Okay. You're not assigned to cooking. Didn't we put you on cooking, Eric? Oh, no, it's Ray. Sorry. Oh, yeah, Ray's, Ray. <laughs> Ray's raging. Let's have a little look. Eric. Come on. We desperately need another cook. Well, make me some meals. Okay, what have we got? We're going to bulk good traders coming in. Oh, yeah, we had this as well. Look at this. This is a an antis, which was an insect. That come in and nearly wrecked the whole base. So we're going to get some insect meat from that. Some car carapace. What do we get there? Poison gland. What the heck are we going to do with that? I've got some tomatoes there as well, so we have we have got food. See? Making fruit salad. Raw meat twenty six has rotted away. That's not what we want. Oh brilliant. <laughs> Maverick has died of malnutrition. Ah. Uh, meanwhile, these are just making the rooms nice. Look, they're just oh. <laughs> We're having a party anyway. Apparently we're having a party. I don't know why we're having a party. Everyone's raging. I'll try and get you to calm them down. We need to get rid of the body of Maverick as well. Now let's let's get you to go and join the party. Go and join the party. And Eric, what are you doing? We just need everyone to try and get this party. Okay, we've got another another traders coming. Right, so we've got four people partying. Oh, when did you die as well? Oh, this this, this playthrough is not going well. We're down two people. Okay, the party is ended. Let's go and try and trade with them. And can someone bury these bodies? Okay, here we go. So, what have I got to get rid of? Um, I could get, I'm going to sell the panda, the alpaca, and the other alpaca. Give myself some money. I need, I need food. I'm desperate for food. But I don't want to just buy in stuff like uh, kibble. Let's have a little look. Like down near the end, is there anything I can buy that's going to help me? Vodka. Vodka might help. We got all the seeds though. I'm gonna get all get tomato seeds. What for, what for food seeds have we got? There's onion. I don't think we can. I'm sure we've got a lot of onions. There's not a lot we can do with them. We have got banana seeds. We can plant trees with that. I know that. Um. Nothing really food wise, is there? He's got. He's got quite a lot of tomatoes, but I can't really keep food around. I'm just making sure there's nothing I can get rid of that I don't need. Um, he's not really got a lot of ammo. All right. Oh, he's not got enough money, has he? I'm trying to get a thousand off him. We need to buy something else off him then. What else can we buy? That's worth a little bit. Gold. I can get some gold off him. Gold is going to be uh, good to uh, have in future. There we go. That'll do me. So we'll trade with them. Where are you taking that body? Oh! You buried one of the colonists in the uh, sarcophagus. Cool. And the tomatoes are getting used there. Let's bury Maverick as well. So that means we've not got anyone doing science at the moment. We're going to have no one doing science. Another person's going to get m buried in there. Are they guinea pigs? Certainly look like it. Okay, let's go and trade with these. See what these have got? They've got mouse ears. 
Whoa, what, what has just come into this town? <laughs> They've got mouse ears. Right, again, I need food. Uh, you've got a lot of money. Ooh, 5,000. I'm going to get rid of all my... Let's get rid of all my booze. Um... Now you've got some decent amounts of ammo here, so we need we need to see what ammo we need. Um, also, seeds. So let's just look. Orange seed. No. We'll just accept that for now. Let's go look on Bren. Now Bren uses what ammo is on is on this gun? It is nine nineteen millimeter para. The only other person that had a gun, we've got a shotgun. And we've got these guns. So that use is the same. And what about the shotgun? 12 gauge ammo. Okay, let's come back to you. Let's trade with them again. So can I use any of this ammo? Oh, I don't think I can. We can use that stuff. 12 gauge shells. Slugs. Um, yeah, I guess we could get some of this. Let's get some of that slug ammo. How much would it cost for all of it? Yeah, it's going to complete... Yeah, it's, we don't need that much. Should we get like a hundred? Get a hundred. Now, I did get... Didn't I get a machine gun in like one of the early episodes and I didn't have ammo for it? Do you know what? I'm sure I did. I could have sworn I did. That's not it. Hot water tank. I think maybe I saw it and didn't buy it. Hey, what are you doing? Hey, Dallas has suddenly woken up now. Good. Go and have a smoke. Use the toilet. Now, we've got a crisis, so we do need to get someone else doing the research, so... None of these are that good. <laughs> Typical. Bren Lion is good, but you are our main hunter. Speaking of hunting, how's the, the meat processing going? Right, so we have got some of the meat processed there. So let's make Arik a hauler. Dallas is resting in there. Falcon's resting. Dallas is healed up now as well. Good. Go and get me some bananas. Ray's no longer walking in a psychotic mood. Right. I think they were the ones we traded with already. Don't think we had two lots of people come in. Or did we? Oh, maybe we did. We need we need a uh, Forgan to wake up before we can do the trades. Come okay, on. Someone needs to haul my uh, slugs as well. Right, he's woke up. He's gone to drink tea. No, go and trade first. Okay, I've got poor health apparently. Have we got any 90mm ammo? No, we have not. Well, that's no good. There's no canned goods or anything. Right, I think it's not worth me buying any of that. I don't know what. What poor health has Forgan got? Just double check. Bright environment. Oh, he's now. Oh, brilliant! Now he's addicted to psychite. <laughs> he didn't have any drug problems before. Now he does. My right, falcon, you best be cooking. You are not. Apparently, you are cooking. Can someone please get that stuff out of here? Look, so we've got we've got food there. Plenty of food from there. Arik is on a, a nicotine binge. Oh, 
going to lead them to it. Let's just speed this right up. Yeah, so it's not looking too good at all, this uh, this series. It's, um, I think we are just going to keep struggling with the people having nicotine addictions and just addiction, addictions in general. Um, I'm, con I'm constantly trying to cheer people up, and it's not working. Hey, at least we finally got some, some amazing fertilizer there. I wanted that for so long. I mean, we have got our uh, fields here as well. Sadly, we need to have skill level 10 to do growing. And it looks like no one is actually skilled enough to plant it anymore. I think we might have to do a separate grow zone. And try and get them a little bit um, more, um, what's the word for it? Skilled. Not really got an awful lot of low level plants though. I can put hay grass down. Maybe we can do mangrove tree. What would be a good thing to do? Should we try and do some hay grass? Can anyone can anyone do growing? Under skill level one. Right, Forgan can do it. At least we've got one person that can do it. Anyway, I'm going to uh, leave that there for now. I think before the next episode, I'm just going to play it and see if I can actually get these to recover for a, uh, you know, to get like a bit more of a stable food source in. Uh, failing that, then I'm going to have to just like abandon this and start again because this isn't really going anywhere. And this is about like, episode eight now. And I, ju I just feel like we're not actually managing to make any headway with this. So let me know what you think in the comments. Anyway, that's it for now. I'm Shirley Rocks. This is RimWorld Hardcore SK. Well, thank you for watching. This is Shirley Rocks and that's been Hardcore SK.